here we are back at the starting point of the hub again. I've gone through all 37 maps that uh, were finished on my run from 1 to 60 as they were added, and now I'm going to go back and do a couple that were finished along the way. So map 4 is the first one, uh, which is Back to Simple by Bruno Levi Constantio. I think so. But anyway, I'm going to stay quiet because I want you to listen to this. So I'm, I'm apologize for the gunshots getting in the way. <laughs> But uh, this is a totally unexpected remake of the uh, default music that I put into this uh, project. And it's been put through some kind of amazing Mega Jive sound font. I absolutely love it. More than my original. <laughs> This reminds me of, um, oh, what's it called? The fourth level in Doom 1. Command control, maybe? Whoa! Dead in seconds. That's more like it. I wonder what caused that crate to go down. It was, it was just up there, okay. This way seems better. Oh, not anymore. Alright, let's get that red key. Oh, I didn't notice the rocket launcher before. Ow! Oh. These Doom map makers are getting tricky. Oh, pinky behind me. so hard to push into the room when door fighting would be so much to my advantage. But yeah, this is a difficult room to get into. What opened? Oh, I just bring that down, that's great. Oh, that opens, okay. Alright, still missing a red key though, which was uh, cruelly snatched away from me earlier. Monsters behind there. Alright, can I get in now? No, I can't! That is hysterical! Alright. 
Is it just when I'm going over that way? Yes, it is. Okay, good. Let's let them out this way. With some rockets. Alright, uh, oh there's a switch. Oh, that's the end, okay. Bit of a surprise ending, it didn't look like an exit switch, however, um, that red key has got to be the most devious, hilarious uh, decoy that I've seen in a very long time. Alright, uh, where are we going next? Um, Downtown Demon Dig is this one. Uh, I, I've walked past this one several times and I've been very intrigued as to its name, so let's see. All right, this will be... Sounds like a city map already. And we've immediately got the prompt that jumping's allowed in this map, which I still haven't implemented for myself. It's a little uh, transformer box. Shotgun on legs. Right. Actually, can we go through there? We cannot. Okay. Because I use that texture as a as a remote triggerable door all the time. So now I think it's remote triggerable door everywhere. Here we go. I was about to say it's in danger of getting a bit plain here because all the walls are the same and it's all the same uh, surface, but I think just as it was starting to stay as welcome, uh, it changes. Okay, this is going to give me a kicking. There we go. I like a better weapon. Let's see. Didn't encounter any chain gunners, did I? Hmm. Sometimes when I make a noise like that, I'm just uh, checking to see if the microphone's working to see if I get the line in the bottom of my screen. I think that imp might have been stuck on an edge. Or he's just very inattentive. Let's crawl through the vents like John McClane. You know, I'm still not quite over the fact that there aren't going to be any more films with Alan Rickman in them. Uh-huh. No traps? Seems to be fine. This actually reminds me of uh, Metal Gear Solid, the very first one, uh, where you were crawling through these vents and going up and down the, uh, up and down the, around that uh, tank room, I think it was, and there was a guard standing outside the vent, and you could tie his shoelaces together or something. Right, what do we do with the blue key? We find a blue door to put it in. Oh, hang on a minute. I haven't been here. Oh, wow, this is a... Uh, this is like a heretic map. It's a berserk. I'll save it for if I need a boost. Oh, 
the, the, the Egyptian burial site around here. Is that a vending machine? All right, what's in here? The doors, yeah, the door tracks move with the door here. You can, if you lower on peg, then uh, the door tracks won't move when the door goes up. But again, it might be the effect you're going for to have a door that's uh, supported by uh, pistons on the side or something. Okay. A nice little barbecue down there. I found a single shotgun. It's not very super, is it? You'll come back. Oh, I heard a pain elemental. You've been painting quite a lot, haven't you? Elemental because it births things and, and birth is pain. Uh, it, it might be called that if this were Silent Hill, but unfortunately it's not. As you know, I've witnessed the miracle of birth and this is absolutely horrifying. There's no miracles here, you're just standing up fanning someone with a disused sick bag. And I remember uh, when Penny, who at that point resembled a potato, uh, was finally out, they gave me the cord to cut, and I remembered what I wanted to say, and I, wanted, I, I said, I declare this baby open, I cut the cord, and then I fainted uh, into a strategically placed chair that one of the nurses had put behind me. It was such an odd feeling. It was like it was like a cut my own power cord. I, I suddenly couldn't stand up. Right, I'm back. It's not gonna, gonna bother now. Just a hid behind a lamppost at the last moment there. But I still haven't used my blue key. <laughs> I've done a lot of things over there. Where did you come from? I didn't mean to pick that up, but I'll take it anyway. Something over there. Just after stopping off for the berserk at the cafe. Telephone. Oh. Ring, ring. Hello, this is a lost soul. No, it's not a lost soul. It's a soul sphere. That's what I meant to say. Um. What now? I've, I've been all through here. I, I just want to check another time. Done that. Crawl through there, that's the start. Where else can I go? Oh, I can, can I go in this door? Yeah, I can. Alright, I didn't notice. 
cafe has seen better days. Oh, I love the sink! That is great! Someone's left a tap running there. And that doesn't look very hygienic. Well, this was quite a big room, but uh, for not a lot of action. Where should I be looking now? Alright. Let's see what's around here. There looked like there was a... Uh, oh no, there wasn't. Uh, that was the Lost Soul secret. Like, Lost Soul? I said that again. Lost Soul. Supercharge. Uh, soul Sphere. Whatever you want to call it, as long as it's not Lost Soul, because that's wrong. Yeah, let's go back here, because I, I definitely didn't finish this route. The bootcase is surprisingly not a secret, even though it looks an awful lot like one. What did I what did I do here? I didn't get I didn't go this way, that's my problem. I went that way, okay. And for some reason I, I never explored down this route. I glad I had the excursion to get the secret there. Okay, let's see what's inside here. Oh, we're getting on to the bigger enemies now. Alright, I pressed something and it did something. Not sure what, I'll get back to you. Oh yeah, that's the... Oh, the Revenant, okay. A lot of health around. Mm. And uh, usually when I say this, it turns out there's a great big teleporter that I've missed. But uh, to prevent the player from backtracking, it's nice to give them either a teleporter or just naturally make the route uh, go back to the main path. I mean, for uh, in that case, uh, and now that I come to think of it, I didn't try walking out the window. Uh, in that case, you could just make the window bigger and uh, have the player get right down to where they want to be. Otherwise, if you want to make the player backtrack, then change the route as they backtrack. Put some more monsters on it. Or even block their original route and make them go back a different way. There's our blue door. Unfortunately, we've got some other ones still to go. Oh, that was an autosave, which means something big's coming. There he is. All right, that's him sorted. There's a bit of a problem with this. Um, I'm not entirely sure if I want it's just a missing texture on the entire wall there, I think. Oh, something bad's gonna happen. Nothing bad has happened. 
This makes me more nervous. I made it. No problems at all. All right. What's this one? Over there, all right. Oh, what a decision. You've got two very urgent things to deal with here. All right, that's uh, two to go. We're going to do another tricky jump here. Not end up in that hole. Pinky, is it going to be one more? There's one more monster left. Oh yes, okay. Yeah, I would definitely give the player uh, teleports back if, if uh, there's nothing else to do on the way back. And, uh, but that's the end. Interesting going through a lot of areas. Uh, you've got the uh, sort of underground base at the start, leading up to the town, which is unexpected, and then inside this castle outdoor area, and finally this uh, Egyptian tomb. All right. Where am I going next? Uh, it's called Soulless, and I can't remember where it is, so we're going on the journey. Not that one. Not that one. I don't think it's right there. It might be... No, it's not down here. That's a work in progress not named yet. That's Tapestry of Stones. Might be up on the top floor. So why am I going this way? You know what? While I'm looking for that, let's do Random Ghost as well. This is another CBM map. Oh, wow. I don't know what's going on here. And I don't like it. What I do like is this music. I'm not doing that. Louge? I can't, I can't quite read it. Oh, hang on a minute. Where are you going? We will be dealing with stealth monsters, it would seem. Can I survive that? Yes, I can. Okay. Let's get rid of these barrels, because a stealth monster plus barrels is going to be trouble. Stealth monster plus anything in this trouble. Uh, what, where, where have I gone? All right. It's a little alphabet carpet. It's got. <laughs> I suppose the um, secrets indicated by the path continuing into the wall. But uh, I found it completely by accident without looking. More of those, please. There's got to be a weapon in here. There it is. Did I just miss that? Was it open before? Never mind. Got it now. That's not a trigger, is it? No. Oh, as I've detailed before, probably not a good idea to go exploring in the bells. All right, exit's going to be achieved with a blue key. Oh, ah, nice rocket. Suspicious of this big empty corridor. All right, now I've got uh, a good weapon to indicate ghosts.
Now, how do I get there? Storage area, okay. Oh, is that lounge, perhaps? Yeah, okay, it's missing a letter. Yeah, let's go down here. Uh, oh no, I did go down there, and I got the minigun. So where now? Oh, I can duck, okay. Should have tried that. A lot of the trouble uh, I'm having with uh, Rampart, the uh, compiling system for this, is that I designed it to be uh, really straightforward for beginners to use, and accidentally blocked a lot of advanced users from using it. But I'm thinking of just now, in particular, is the jump and crouch. Because I made it uh, so that you just submitted a allow my map to jump and crouch property when you submitted online, and it would write the map info for you. But then some people decided, uh, because obviously that's how you write a Doom map, with a map info, uh, they would just do it in that. So I had to report that, I had to support that as well. And then I had to support people who contradicted each other <laughs> on the map info and that option. Where was he? Oh, that's it. Turns out he was there. Oh, I thought that was just fog, but it's glass. There we go. The uh, light set in underneath the tiling is really good. It's a megasphere there. I don't really need it. No doubt I'll come back when I do. Blue key. Quite a lot of artwork. Hmm. Looks like a little uh, ZZT RPG, then. What a strange gallery. Oh, I suppose I've got the blue key. What else is there to do? I'm not sure if that was the best use of my bullets, but... Oh, there's another one. Just glass stained on my keyboard for a tiny bit. Alright, we're gonna punch them. It's not the exit, is it? It is the exit! Okay! I just failed to find a couple of monsters. A short and sweet map, uh... The generally the fewer uh, <laughs> stealth monsters, the better, and I think that uh, was a good length for having that gimmick. Let's see, was is there edgy world name there? Where did I put this one? Soulless, there it is. All right. Uh, can I can I get that, please? Thank you. Oh, I'll use this one. Well, that was a uh, trouncing. Let's just go in here, but I'm not be shot by a spider.
Well, I like the scenery of this map. You know, it's nothing outlandish, but it, do it does things really well uh, within the constraints of the Doom engine. I just want to get out of the line of fire of things for a bit. This is not it. Um. Ah! I stood valiantly, but in the end fell apart. Alright, you're getting a third go at this map. Finding this so difficult. Go, run over there, get the shotgun, get out. It's because there's no hiding place for that spider. You can't retreat. There you go. There's a very easy hiding place for that spider. Let's deal with these. So that's a bit more firepower. Oops! Oh god, am I th this is such a short map and I'm playing it four or five times. Losing it. Yeah, it lost spidey four legs. All right, let's try and survive this room this time. <sighs> and so in here... All right, yeah, that was just a way back to here, uh, which uh, killed me with a load of demons before. That's given me the red key, that's given me a spider, but I'll just take this alternative route back and through the lava, burn my own legs off, and then slowly expire. Maybe it's time to go to bed. I have played through four... Through the, I, th I think I've played through 14 or 15 of these maps today. I'll spread the video out over time. But that'd be great for quite a while. Oh, not enough room. Oh dear. Oh, everyone at once! Oh, the floor disappears. Ah! Is there any chance of getting that day? Can I get it from here? Maybe. Yes, I can. All right. Doesn't help my ammunition. But at least I'll live a bit longer to punch them to death.
Good. Okay. There's nothing left up here, is there? Stuck on the stairs. I barely felt that. Ah. Okay, back to nil nil, and it's uh, 14 monsters still to go. Oops. Oh, that was a gun. And there's going to be one down at the trap floor, uh, which isn't through this way actually, it's not this way. Sorry. Student is out. All right. All right, so this switch, this teleporter, leads to... I can slip down here. Well, at least I've got a full complement of uh, shells. Sometimes you've got to take advantages while you have them. I don't know what you're doing right there. Ah, what happened there? Oh, the Megasphere came down. Didn't have to cooperate after all. Oh, juggled by a team! Let's do that again. Not that we have uh, much choice, really. But I try to sound determined. Cock. I can't believe I'm doing this bad. This, this is absolutely embarrassing at this point. Here we go. One. Well, he got the rest. But we won't let it get to us. Yeah, this is a much better vantage point. Where is he? Oh, you revived over a line def without height uh, restrictions. Great, okay, that's much better. Missed. Alright, there's one more of you. Who's it gonna be? Thank you. There we go, Solus is finished. That was a very neat short map. I have no idea why it gave me such difficulty. Uh, well, because of the cramped space and uh, a lot of demons at the start, and uh, then just some unexpected surprises later on, but... That just says it's a, it's a good, surprising map. Gonna have to think about how to decorate the rest of this place soon. There'll probably be a lot more levels to fill it. <laughs>